This is EA Sports coverage of the PGA Tour. Hello again and welcome, Rich Lerner, alongside my friend and colleague, Frank Navalo. We are along the Paracel Islands in the South China Sea. Frank, on a mission here today, what can you tell us about this course? Well, one thing, Rich, we don't have fatigue out there, so I've got my battle gear on. Interesting layout ahead. Uh, plenty of water, the island's there to be ne negotiated, navigated, and you never know what just might pop up during the course of the game. And partner, let me just, before we get started, salute you. I salute you too, Rich. You ready? Ready. Aim. Fire. Playing a full 180 yards now. Strong winds have been a factor all day here, Frank. What's the key to scoring low in conditions like this? Well, sometimes you've almost got to uh, make the ball go to ground. You've just got to keep it out of those high breezes, uh, play away from the trouble. Frank, so many different lies in golf. This is one you don't see too much. The golf ball is, is on the mulch. Yeah, and it never really sits up. So this is one of those ones you've got to be much more conservative than you'd like to be. Play for the fat of the green. Solid play, heart of the green. Settles in over the putt. Drops it, and he's at even par. Frank, as we look at the second, your average hole was, say, a few bunkers, maybe even a pond. That would be a walk in the park compared to what I'm seeing right here. Yeah, early surveillance said uh, that guard shack, just the right of the green, is actually not empty. So be a little aware of that when you cross the bridge. Green just uh, 167 yards away, though, from the tee. This is a good looking shot. That is a really good shot landing close to the flag stick. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Oh, I thought he had that. Well, there's an opportunity wasted. Just knocking him for a par, and let's forget about this one. Um, golf is not about perfect, but it's going to hurt the course. Even par early on. So this is an interesting tee shot as that destroyer continues to burn. Amazing that place still continues. Frank, there's a real art to putting a good 72-hole score in the book, isn't there? Yeah, there is. You know, you can have a, a flash of brilliance, make five or six birdies. It can be offset by doubles and quadruple bogeys. And in the end, it's, it's the end. What did you do? The plus and the minuses. And, and that's why all our biggest championships have, uh, and of recent, been stroke play. Rich, there's nothing worse than this. This might look all right, but in the mulch, this is a disastrous situation. So this is not mulch ado about nothing? Ah, I get it. Second shot. And he's made it onto the green now. And getting ready for the putt. 
to leave in par for the day. Frank, here at the fourth, there's an awful lot going on. There certainly is. Solar panels, uh, radar tower, tower is up and ready to go, so it will confirm the landing on the other side if it's successful. This uh, rather long par three, around the 230 yard mark, so this is going to be all carry. If it land that ball on the green, it will not run through that beach area. And of course, the trees and the palm trees all the way around. If this isn't flighted properly, it will not find the destination. Seems like too much for just one man. This looks like a job for an entire flight crew, Frank. Well, Rich, we should dig ourselves a trench and see what happens. Into the thick stuff, that's a difficult lie. Just trying to make clean contact from the rough. Even par, currently. Nothing wrong with that par putt. Frank, you and I have called golf from around the world. Places like, well, the hot air balloon in the Grand Canyon comes to mind. This has uh, been a, a rather unusual spot as well. It is. I thought we'd be safe up here in the observation uh, tower, Rich. But I don't know, with that boat coming in, or should I say the destroyer, I don't exactly feel safe right now. But we'll batten down the hatches as we watch the tee shot at the fifth. Whoop, this has taken off on a weird line. And it's going to be in the rough, it looks like. And that one rolls just into the rough. Now you have to decide whether or not that ball's going to fly or not. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Hut for par. He needs one. He's made it. Frank here at the sixth, a really fascinating hole. It is uh, mid sort of 200 yards, shared greens, a bit like St. Andrews. But because you're hitting it over an island, you're almost going to have to parachute this uh, tee shot in here and get it to land softly. There's a lot of things going on behind to the left and the side. It's like a little village that you're heading into. Hopefully you don't need a passport. Rich, there's rough and rough. That ball is needle nose down. Can't even see it from here. And he's made the green. That's a par, and that keeps the scorecard clean, still even for the round. Frank, looking at this hole, a player is going to need a detailed map from high above, maybe from the bomber squadron flying overhead, just to get a sense of what they're trying to navigate. You can always go up in uh, one of those two lookout towers, just check the direction of the wind see which way it's coming from, but not an overly long par three. Wow, way to the right here. And there's rough over there. So off the tee here at the par three, not his best stuff, but still a chance to make the three. Yeah, that was a poor miss off the tee. Let's see if he can redeem himself. This requires a lot of speed through the ball.
Did the job right there. Now at the 8th here at Paracel Storm, this is a relatively short hole, but if you notice off to the left, Frank, there is a basketball court, and that allows me the chance to say, from way downtown, yes! Well, if you miss this green, you might be able to sign up, too. There's uh, plenty of barracks. You can just uh, take a left turn, go into there and enlist. But if you want to keep playing, par 3, under 200 yards, and see if you can safely get on deck. Oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Looking to make a move. This putt for birdie. Good putt. And now one under par. Rounding out this front nine mission here, the ninth hole, shot over the building. I need to be careful. The front left of the screen is guarded by a tower, and anything right, you'll be ducking for cover in the trenches. Been a real battle out here today. Just need to keep it all together. Should be pretty good right there on the safe side. Chance to close out the front side here with a birdie. Back to back birdies, we'll see. Well, that would have been a bonus had it gone in, but still, reasonable chance for par here. Yeah, there's no damage. Uh, you're not going to birdie every hole. That's one under on the day. Well, that was a nearly flawless performance on the front side, but Frank, we know it's an 18-hole game, isn't it? That's right. Now's not the time to pat yourself on the back. Oh, this is straight at it. It's a really good line. Early part of this back nine and a good approach shot. Now we'll have this for birdie. Really? This is an awkward length. That was a good-looking putt, just not falling right now. No, sadly, he's going to be disappointed. Just a couple of feet. Good work right there. He'll settle for par. Eleventh hole here at Paracel Storm, now a military playground. Frank, certainly the players are thankful having traded the guns for golf clubs. Good time out. Has to be played across that seawall. So once again, all carry. And let's see if he can land softly on the other side. Well, this one should be safely on deck here. Chance for birdie after that beautiful shot. Birdie chance here. Very long putt, though. Got to be a little careful if it gets away on him.
Well, you couldn't ask for much more than that, except to make it. He has this attempt for par. One under for the round. Up to the 12th, making a trip across to an island green, Frank. It looks more like a shipwreck island, and that's an evil place to put the green on that side. Uh, very well defended by that rock wall as well as the water. And of course, anything short, those big rocks that protect this green. This is probably the most heavily guarded par three on the golf course. Make bogey or worse here, they might strand you out there. You can't hide the flagstick from that man. He is just uh, unbelievable, that. That never deviated offline. Has to like that one, another birdie to get to two under par. Going right back to the large island here at the 13th, Frank. Trenches uh, behind will certainly protect anything that goes a little bit long. Left of this green, you better call in the Navy. This is heading in the wrong direction. Uh-oh. Pretty good shot right there. Settles in over the putt. With authority, count it as a par and two under. Frank now at the 14th and really a simple objective here. It looks like an old sand dune where they've just put a green on top, uh, rather benign. It might just sneak up on you though. It really just looks like green and beaches with a few palm trees behind, but beware. Surely not. Midway through this back nine could use this birdie here at the 14th. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Just singes the edge, Frank. Yeah, but at least he's burning the edges. You know you're hitting good parts. Trying to move on with a par in his pocket. Workmanlike hole, he walks away with a par. Now to the 15th and Frank, where exactly is the green here? Well, I think you need the jungle book to try and decipher this one. A little short par three up and over there. There is a green in amongst that jungle, and even the green has its own little mini jungle in it. This is one of my favorite holes on this golf course. Seems to like it. Looks like it's headed for the green. He's making the game look very simple right now. See it, hit it, and he's got it right on track. Third birdie of the round. 16th hole here at Paracel Storm, and Frank, as we begin this closing stretch, strikes me, this is tough guy golf out here, isn't it? Well, it certainly is. Uh, if you want to earn your stripes by playing this golf course, this is the place to be. In the spirit of conservation, we have some solar panels to boost up 
the finish, and uh, the hole not overly long. Let's see what the lieutenant can do this time. He's knocked it on the green, but not in a great position. This is a difficult chance coming up here. Long birdie try. Always two components to the long lag, but the speed, number one, and then the read, and missed out on that second part. This from about 10 feet. Knocks that putt in for par to stay at three under. Out of the 17th hole, and as we come to the end of this round, you salute the players because they're out there carrying not only their golf clubs, but the med kits and the meal packs, because this is no ordinary golf course. You have to be on alert, high guard all the time. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all the way. Birdie try up next. Boy, this could be a tough one right here, Frank. It's a very long putt, Rich. Obviously, it's difficult, uh, but he still has a shot to sink this one for birdie. Rich, do you think we should tell him this fairway out there? Yeah, he's been in the rough all day long. This requires a lot of speed through the ball. Oh, yes, he's holding, Frank. Unbelievable, from that distance. Frank, the job is almost complete here at the 18th hole, and a good job at that, as we have seen some spectacular golf here at Paracel Storm in the South China Sea. Just one more battle ahead. The difficult 18, should they succeed, then I think they're worthy of a salute. Oh, this is right at it. That is an excellent play right there. The approach giving him another good look. These putts keep the round together. Didn't go in, Frank, but not a bad effort. And he's putting for par now. And he makes it for par. Really good round out there today. What's the mindset, Frank, to keep it going? The first thing, really, Rich, just try and keep the same composure for tomorrow's round. Get some rest, we know that. Um, shouldn't really have to hit the range. Swings in good position. Just uh, keep it easy and visualize how tomorrow's gonna pan out.